If the federal budget is a reflection of our values, then clearly this administration doesn't value America's working and middle class families. It guts investments in early childhood education, medical research and infrastructure, and charges Americans more for college, health care, and even flood insurance. It also punishes working families, children, people with disabilities, and seniors by eviscerating Medicaid. And what are they doing with this money? Blowing a hole in the deficit in order to give tax cuts to millionaires, real estate moguls, and wealthy corporations. And I'm not the only one who feels this way. Take a listen to some of my Senate colleagues who share my concerns. This budget hurts the middle class more than any budget I have ever seen. Let's all speak up against this budget that will hurt America and hurt people. We are called to help the least among us. This budget harms the most vulnerable citizens, from children to seniors to our veterans. This budget cuts over $5 billion from medical research. That impacts you. If you have a family member with Alzheimer's or cancer or any disease, this will hurt. You know, the Trump budget does an amazing thing. It leaves rural America behind. We absolutely cannot have that if we're going to develop and improve the quality of life for rural America. This budget gets an F from rural America. This is heartless. What kind of government cuts health insurance for children and cuts children's hospitals? Donald Trump wants to cut the Women, Infants, and Children's program by over a billion dollars. That's obscene. Trump's budget spends more than a billion dollars on his wall along the Mexican border, and it's paid for by you. That ain't gonna happen. Tax cuts for the wealthy won't close our skills gap or train the long-term unemployed, or build the cutting-edge infrastructure our businesses deserve. I want the United States to be the land of opportunity. I want to have the world's most innovative economy. And so I can assure you, I will be fighting this budget with everything I've got.